Dude, you're throwing down too much bread. If those birds come, they're gonna explode. You're thinking of Pepto-Bismol. No, if those birds eat too much bread, they'll explode. You know what, never mind. If they do explode, that'd be sick. It'd be like, nah, I'm all over again. Dude, you're only 23. Dude, I played Battlefield Vietnam. I was practically there. Sorry, veterans. Do you think people eat, like, pigeons? Why would they? They're like, tiny, they have no meat. Yeah, but we rarely eat anything that flies. What about duck? That doesn't count. I have eaten a hawk before, but... You've eaten a hawk? Yeah, when I was little, I, uh... Thinking about it, I probably should have taken off the feathers. I'm hungry. Here. Dude, I have some news. What's up? So, Karen's gonna be moving in with us. What? When did this happen? We decided it a few weeks ago. We just thought it'd be easier than her having to ride her horse across town to see me. Yeah, I don't get that. Why doesn't she have a car? She's afraid of cup holders, so she got a, a horse. So you're moving in with a woman who bought a horse in the 21st century. Yeah. Why didn't anyone consult me that we were moving in with Paul Revere? Okay, we decided, we just thought it'd be part of our relationship. I'm part of your relationship. How the hell are you part of our relationship? I'm the third wheel. I am crucial to the structure and integrity of your relationship. Okay, then why do you have such a problem with her? One, she smells bad. Second of all, what if one night in a drunken state, she mistakes our rooms. What? Dude, she's extremely attractive and I'm not going to resist. Okay, first she doesn't smell. She does smell bad. She smells like a horse. Okay, then how come I don't notice it? Because you're around her all the time. Moving on, um, okay, she doesn't drink, so that couldn't happen. And if it did, uh, you better resist because I'd punch your brains in. Which brain? Okay, listen, we've been friends since college. I'd like to think that you two could get along. Does that mean I can't walk around our apartment naked anymore? No, you never did that anyway. Well, I would like to have that option. You never had that option. Listen, it's not that bad. If you guys don't like each other, you're just living in the same house. Just living in the same house? The next step from living in the same house is being attached at birth. Okay, well, why do you have such a problem with her? James, I don't have a problem with her. The real reason I'm giving you such a hard time is that I'm falling in love with okay. you. If you want to joke around, James, I'm James, leaving. James, come on. Don't walk away from your true love. You know we're right for each other. You had me at hello.